Hello everyone and welcome back for some more Manhunt Checkpoint. Let's see, I've um, we've, we've made a few uh, changes for this run. Um, we've got a thing that tells me how big my uh, circle currently is that pops up every so often. So I know how much of a guide the hunters are getting over me, uh, getting to where I am rather. And also more, pos more pos bleh, possibly more usefully for me, um, or more worryingly for me, it also gives me an indication of how... Um, how small the circle is getting and therefore gives me a reason a reason to hurry a bit more, should we say. Now, there are a couple of modifiers on how quickly the circle shrinks as well. So, if I'm in a sports or a supercar, there we go, this is now it's down to 460 metres, so it's um, getting smaller. It starts at 500, so need to keep, keep going. Um, yeah, so if I'm in a sports or supercar, then the circle will shrink more quickly than normal. If I'm in something slow and lumbering, then it'll... Um, there was a shooting going on over there off to the left. Um, if I'm in something slow and lumbering, then it will shrink a bit more slowly. So it's an encouragement to use sort of less practical vehicles and perhaps to... Oops, I meant to be forward, so there we go. Uh, and an encouragement to perhaps... Um, if I do use a, a very fast car for getting across the city quickly, um, to reconsider and think that perhaps maybe I shouldn't. So, there's a hunter. Let's... Um, I hope he hasn't spotted me. Nope, he seems to be going away, which is fair enough. I mean, I wouldn't expect him to recognise me. I, I pulled up fairly sensibly to this um, to this junction, so, you know, should be safe, but we shall see how it goes. So, I'm trying to get to the casino bridge. That's the first of my checkpoints. As always, I'm trying to get through all of the checkpoints before the hunters stop me. The hunters are trying to stop me by identifying me and then ramming me off the road, and that's, oh, there's another hunter. I really want a green light, because I'm sat at the traffic lights, and I feel that's bad for my... Um, survivability. Ooh, those are going red what now. Maybe. Going yep, do? there we go. My turn. Now, I'm aware at this point that I'm following that the, where the hunters just went. And that's probably... It's not ideal, but also it's not the sort of thing they'd expect me to do, because it's a fairly silly idea. So, if I can hide behind this bus, maybe we can just sort of go along with all the other AIs and try and do what they do. Now, let's see, Tristan's lurking over there, Mark has gone away but might come back again. I think I'm going to sit here and wait till this light goes green. Um, there is a car parked in the middle of the junction, which is presumably not going to go anywhere. There's some panicking, panicky AIs going on. Um, presumably that uh, driver has been shot because they drove a nice car. Okay, down to 430 metres. This really does actually add on to the pressure I feel, because it's... Um, it's another sort of thing to get to make me paranoid. So I'm just going to keep. What's going on over there? I can hear fighting, but it's not, nothing to do with me, as far as I'm aware. <laughs> okay, that's Pete over there as well. So we've got three of the hunters in this area, which I mean, given that they know that I'm in this general area because of the circle, isn't too surprising. But on the but also it's. Is, is a bit of a concern. Maybe maybe they'll sort of bump into each other a bit and we can just sort of head off while they're noobing around. There we go, like that. Okay, are they... I want to go one more block over before I turn, before I turn left, because then it's a nice, easy run up to the checkpoint. So far, I think I'm behaving myself quite well. I'm not in the sort of car I normally favour, so hopefully that means they're not going to be too suspicious of me. But also, it looks like... What's that new um, that new Lamborghini SUV that they made? The um, I can't remember what it's called, but it, I think it looks a bit like it looks a bit like this one. So if this is actually a Lamborghini under the um, under the hood, then maybe it'll be reasonably good if I get into a chase. It does look like, it looks like a posh SUV, sort of even posher than, the, than a Range Rover somehow. So maybe it'll be reasonably quick. It'll still probably have all kinds of issues as soon as I try and corner in it. There was what was it? There, oh yeah, I used the um, I forget what it's what it what it was called. The something XL in in the in in a, in a recent episode, and uh, that was interesting because it was really really heavy and powerful. It was great at barging hunter cars out of the way, but then I went then I tried to take a corner. I got a load of oversteer. It went sideways and it hit a um, hit a curb and flipped over. So <laughs> it really didn't pass the moose test, and that's why why I don't like SUVs. Um, both in game and in real life. They're not the right... They're not the sort of vehicle I favour, put it that way. Uh, 
chance of a green light. There we go. Is there anyone behind me? No. Excellent. I'm going to carry on along here. Then I'm going to take a left turn. Because I don't want to leave the city. That will just be unhelpful. I don't really want to stop at a red light, though, to be honest. Um, especially as... Yeah, there's a bit of damage to the front of my car. And that was actually done by a hunter, which means it's very likely to have synced with their computer. So, so if, they, if they see me... It'll probably, if Mark sees me particularly, then it'll probably the damage will probably be there and visible, and he might get suspicious. But we'll see. what is that motorbike doing? They came here flying in at high speed, as if they were panicking, and now they're just sort of creeping along and sitting in the middle of the road. There's Tristan again, coming in to sort of be unhelpful. Let's head off this way and hope he hasn't recognised me. No, he hasn't. I am, however, going completely the wrong direction. And my circle is back up to 450 meters, so that's, 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 that's convenient because um, it gives me a bit more time to you know, get to the next checkpoint. But I think I'm going to have to put my foot down a bit and just hope that the hunters aren't, aren't lurking in this area. Because to get to oil, it's quite a long way to oil fields. This also isn't really the right sort of car for, for the oil fields area. So I should probably consider changing, maybe to something like that. A muscle car. I'm not. I was going to say I'm not sure my character model looks quite right for a um, for a muscle car, but eh, maybe it'll do. Um, okay, no hunters around. Let's let's get a shift on. So I need to cross over the it's a storm drain at this point, isn't it? Yes, I need to cross over the storm drain and the highway and all that sort of thing to get over to the oil fields area. That's down this way. Drive around that. There we go. And a ruiner should blend in quite nicely. Now, to be honest, I think trying to pick a car that blends in in the area that I'm going to is probably unnecessary. I don't think the hunters are sufficiently used to the um, car, used to spotting specific cars in specific areas that they'll go, "Hang on, why is there a whatever that Enus thing was in in the in the oil fields?" <clears throat> However, there's no point in taking a risk, so I think. Uh, muscle cars and that sort of thing are probably fairly. I feel like that. I feel like they should be fairly common over here. Um, better than maybe slightly above average, but at least reasonably normal and fitting the sort of the typical spawn set around here. So, let's head over towards the checkpoint. I think I've come down here sufficiently slowly that I don't need to feel guilty about going straight for the checkpoint. Um, there's probably going to be a hunter, at least one hunter in the area, potentially even waiting in the checkpoint for me. So I, th I think I can just go straight for it and, and just take it on the way through. Especially as my circle is shrinking. <laughs> it hasn't gone below 400 meters yet, so that's probably probably reassuring. If I obey the traffic laws a little bit, I'll, so I'll sit here for a moment. Yep, there's Mark. So we we do have a hunter in the in the vicinity of the checkpoints at least. So I don't need to feel too bad about doing this. Oop, that wasn't a great um, line through it. Is he following me? Is he following me? I don't see him. If I turn right here, I can turn right on a red, which is sort of allowed, I don't know. That one did say stop on red, so it possibly isn't. But this means I can then get get out of here a little bit on the highway. Um, head off, try and try and get myself back towards the main part of the city, because the odds of the next checkpoint being west of here are pretty high, because most of the city is west of here. Um, I actually meant to be on the road higher up, but never mind. Chinese Monument. That's another long drive. Oh, goodness sake. Okay. Um... In that case, I'm going to cross here, like so. Yeah, and if I follow this road round to the right here, that'll take me on the highway, and I can head over towards the next checkpoint. And I'll try and do reasonably appropriate highway speeds, I guess. I don't want to... I don't want, as I get, as, Again, I don't want to zip over there too quickly. Um... Because they should definitely have a chance, but they'll see the they'll see the circle moving. They'll know that I'm moving this way fairly quickly, so they're going to know that I'm off for the next checkpoint now. And presumably that'll mean they'll move to come over and try and cut me off. We'll we'll see. We'll see how it goes. 
uh, 400 meters, I am losing circle size. Even though I'm taking checkpoints, it's still getting smaller. Now this could also be because the maximum size that the uh, circle can be decreases whenever I um, uh, whenever I take a checkpoint. So each time I take a checkpoint, the ma I'm cutting off a bit of my circle. Let's come off here. So we can land that without damaging the car. I can. Good. Uh, that was kind of pointless, I think, because how do I get from here back onto the normal surface streets? Let's try this. Oh, I'm here. Right. <laughs> I usually only do that jump in reverse. I seem to have got away with that as well without any noticeable damage. Good. Man, it's been a Holy shit. Right. I seem to... I'm trying to tell if there's any noticeable damage on the car. I feel like there must be because of that landing. Is this a good place to switch cars? I think it is. We used to have in the um, back in the days when we were playing when we weren't playing with um, the, the modded GTA, we used to have a rule where the um, the prey had to change car between checkpoints. With the again with the same sort of intention of slowing them down a bit so they couldn't just race the whole thing. Um, so that's. And it's also quite a useful thing for the prey to change cars fairly frequently, so they uh, they don't you don't stick out too much because they think, hey, I saw that ruiner a load of, or that whatever it was, um, it was a ruiner I think, uh, loads of times back in the back around the previous checkpoint and so on. So yeah, it's probably a good habit to get into. It was occasionally frustrating though when I found a really good car and wanted to hang on to it, <laughs> and then another good cars weren't spawning. But uh, oh well, they were shooting. It's not far away. Um, there is Mark. There is... I think that's a panicking AI. Um, yes, running away from Tristan. I can't say I blame him, especially if it was him doing the shooting. So I wonder if I wonder if they reckon it is that that AI is me and they're chasing them down to try and um, try and finish them off. I know, he's coming back again now. Maybe it left the circle. And there's Pete as well, so we've got quite a lot of the hunters in this area now. They're not suspicious of me though, which is nice. I say that, they're probably about to be suspicious of me. Because I'm definitely very much in the area. These these two 4x4s are um, messing around a bit, which is nice, and it provides a bit of a distraction. I'm going to run this red light because there's no hunters visible, and that way I get to get a bit closer to the checkpoint. Mike is in the checkpoint, and Pete as well. What? Why is Pete shooting Mike's car? I have no idea, but... I probably should have panicked from that, actually. Yeah, okay. I think Mark is going to be chasing me now because... Ooh, and that wasn't very AI-like driving. Yes, there he is. Okay, so we have a chase now. <laughs> I think that's probably a good thing. I mean, it would be a rather dull run if it if there weren't any chases in it at all. Um, that said, I think he had a, a bit of a, a moment of mischief back there and I've um, managed to throw him off. So... That was quite a short chase. Let's see if we can get in a better one on the next checkpoint. Oh, actually, no, I see. I saw some purple behind me. Yep, that's definitely some purple behind me. Sometimes going around like this works quite nicely, but I took that a bit too slowly, I think. Ooh! Green. <laughs> oh, I was going to say, ooh, that got me up to speed. That was handy, but no, it didn't. It... Which way can I go? Can I go backwards? Can I go forwards? Can I duck? Let's try for a bit forwards. Ah, oh, no, I couldn't. I just couldn't get out of there. I was trapped. The first two went well. I am potentially currently upside down in a pool. <laughs> well done. <laughs> <laughs> Could be a problem.
He's taking it. He's taking it, but the circle's not actually got. Oh, is it yeah, only it just got there? Oh, only just. Yeah, that's a little bit. Potentially a little weak, given how how fast it's moving even now. Um, the other possibility is that the thing is just genuinely too weak. But I, oh no, that's that. That's moving, up speed. moving south. Yeah. I, I think he did that as a massive pedestrian run. Circle's edge is now touching checkpoint. Uh, yes, so... Uh, Were you at the circle at the time, Mark? Yes, repairing. No, the car was as of... just died, I think. I, th I think he's trying something really clever. Like, being on foot or... No, he's doing something super sneaky. Could be just under the highway, so sort of one junction south of our gallery. I think he's closer to the edge than we think. Okay. In that case, it's. I thought that was Pete. It was. Halfway between checkpoint and. Oh! Sudden jump of the circle. Getting close. Hmm. Ah! You shoot me! Pete. What? Me, me and Mark were both in our cars. <coughs> mm -hmm. I just saw Pete get in his car and jump away. What? Taking it. Yeah, I think what? I've got him. Uh, a black car. Uh, moving Heading to, west. I think. Northwest. Yeah, northwest. Multicolor yeah. car park. Yeah, it's him. Ah, uh, I crashed it. I'm on it. Still going past movie studios. Turning right just after movie studios. Then immediately left. I'm and then immediately this one right. tire down. Because Pete. Yep. Uh, south side of Life and Vader. Turning north just after Life and Vader. Uh, turning back north side of Life and Vader heading west. That's the one. They introduced him to a tree. Beautiful. Tire's gone. Come on. Oh, is that not? Oh, you nothing. should. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> I could see the. I was hitting the back of his headrest. Hello again, everyone, and welcome back to Lawrence Plays for some more Manhunt Checkpoint. And there is Mark trying to hunt me. But fortunately, he doesn't know it's me, even though I've got a smashed window, so that's quite good. I um, made the mistake, and I'll be honest it was a bit of a mistake, of, of stealing this car uh, from the side of the road so I had to smash the window in order to get it. I probably shouldn't have, I probably should have got one from sort of the, um, from on the road where I'd be, where I get one that was unscathed, undamaged, didn't have an obvious gaping hole in the side of it like that. Um, but I'm gonna hope that I get away with it anyway because I'm, I'm an optimist I guess, I don't know. Um, because I've got this car and I don't and there's a hunter right there and I don't I can't change cars because he's right there. Now he might be guarding me at this point, which is a little bit of a concern. Um because he might have noticed the broken window and therefore is just keeping an eye on me to make sure I don't go anywhere. Yes, he's definitely following me. It's time to get out of here, I think. Um so we're into a chase already. This is um ooh, not a good start. And I've just hit some cross traffic. Also not a good start. Um, so this isn't, is not ideal, should we say, oh, I'm going to here as well. It's at this point where I think, actually, I should probably just restart this run because I'm completely doomed, because uh, I think I'm going to
going to really struggle to get away from this. Um, yeah, because they're shooting at me. They've taken out one of my tyres. Yeah, I'm in, I'm in a lot of trouble up now. Um, I might get lucky. You never know. Um, I'm going I'm to keep trying, but... <laughs> oh, no, the tyre's gone now. So that's, that's, that's my manoeuvrability gone. I have a small amount of speed because this car is... It's the, it's the slowest in the game, but it's also not particularly quick. Um, my best bet is probably going to be to try and ditch, ditch it somehow, leap out and do, do some cunning on foot. But I don't know if I've got the, op I don't think I'm going to get the opportunity for that because I've now lost another tire. Ah, oh, no, another. I think I have him. Uh, black car uh, moving north. Um, golf course, yeah. yes. South of golf course. North round golf Tire should be gone. But I've lost the chance. Or is, which way do you go where the solo is? Uh, taking a left heading north. Yes, you did get a, at least one tire. Uh, heading back towards golf course. The same way, or you turn west? Uh, heading west. Because I went a different way. Ah, not that. That was a <laughs> remarkably <laughs> lucky shot. Shot! <laughs> sure. I, I like the way that I have no worries. I, I like these updates. 